revealed by that ward, so they realize that this was happening. Still does have Astral, going to use it now onto the Sniper, thinking about turning here. Wants to maybe get aggressive with Kuro in the area, and Miracle sensing a little bit of weakness. Has he overextended? He is going to go down. Freeze drawing first blood. You can hear the adoration of the crowd. Yeah, Miracle just deciding not to... I mean, theoretically, this is part of the reason why you would pick that Bounty Hunter as well, to go in and scout those out. Yep. But meanwhile, ROTK over here in the top lane. They bring in FY, going to commit the Stampede for this. They are going to be able to find that kill. And maybe GH to go down as well. Kuroki trying to save the day. It's not going to be enough. They are going to bring down ROTK, but, well, it's a big price to pay. That is such an important kill. That brew was getting out of control. Kuria, this is perfect timing mid. Yeah, Fenrir. Oh, oh he doesn't okay. quite spot it. Maybe on the back. Perfect timing, but not but aware of man down in the bottom is going to end up dropping far too deep there. And with the courier kill to top it off, BGJ. Very nice little combo there. Yeah, that's money in the bank. That's kind of what I talked about, how VGJ are going to be the aggressors there. I mean, Matu getting aggressive, but he wasn't really going for kills. He was just going greedy, trying to farm behind the tower. This does leave FY alone. The poor man just trying to get his level 6 gets well, crit to the face with a thunderclap. That'll bring him down, but overall a good sequence of events for the VG. Gets level 6, an immediate infest top from the Lifestealer. Oh, if they could kill Mind Control here, this would be so huge. They're thinking about using it. Stampede. Tough kill. He's so tanky. They want the support. They take the free one. All right. Well, Can't blame him there. I... Legit think they would not have killed Mind Control. I mean, if he pops an ultimate, they definitely... This is the moment things turn around at least a little bit. Liquid moving into the area. They have the Blink Dagger up and online. Smoke going to be broken. They jump forward, find Fenrir, commit the ulti as well. They're on top of him. Matumba Man not quite able to find the kill. They do get it there. Mind Control picking it up with that boulder. And now the time to get out at least for the moment. Well, no, they decide to turn. Fight back into RDA. They take him down in spite of the Shrine just outside of the healing now. And looking for Freeze. Can they bring him down? FY trying to make the most of this. He steals Brood Split. Going to try and turn it against them now, but already three are dead. Is he really going to be able to do enough? If he can possibly bring down this OD, it would be some semblance of a turnaround. They get the lift up onto the Ogre as well. Another boulder getting tossed out, but I don't know if they're going to be able to take him down. FY needs to be careful now. Coming out of it, they get the Fire Blast onto the Rubik, looking for the chase. They are going to Steals be able Astral. to run him down. Okay, no. won't get... Oh, well, aggressive here, as well as Fenrir. They end up getting the shuriken toss. They turn it back around and take down two. Three go down for Liquid. Wow, FY, what a player. That fight went so bad for Vici at the start, but the brew split still changed absolutely everything. It gave them an initial kill on the Timbersaur. The bounty hunter there, that it was like the long range boulder toss that actually ended up getting the kill. Well, they're going to be able to control Matumbo Man again. The chase continues in some trouble. Is going to be able to deal out a good bit of damage there to ROTK, trying to dodge away, but he is going to fall. Meanwhile, in the mid lane, they're going He's here surviving. and able to take down Freeze. Well played there. Mind Control going to drop as well as ROTK makes the escape. Track kills again, though. I think, I'm not sure if both would stop, and I think this, this isn't the first time he's gone for it before the Ag Scepter, but... Uh, does suggest that he's not going to have that vision tool at the earliest moment. But against the bounty, you almost need this positioning one. Oh, there's the jump onto Kuro. Gone in an instant, and More they are going to relocate in one. They've still got Stampede, so you've got to really... Ops for 75 health over getting a mix of health and mana. Oh no, he ended up getting caught there for a second and now stunned up Matumba Man. The Ancients, oh my god, he barely gets away from that one. The now they decide to turn. They end up taking down Mind Control before he gets the ulti off. That's, yeah, a big kill as well. It allows him to push without fear. They've still got vision of Matu, but he's going to TP himself home. The bouncing Shuriken almost even chased him down. The vision from this track is proving to be so important. They keep finding kill after kill. Kuro, the next to fall. They are just crumbling right now at this early stage. Not what you would expect from this Team Liquid team that have been so steady and stable throughout the entire oh, yeah. qualifiers and everything. It was the, the first time these two teams met uh, in that best of three that went 2-1. Aggressive's lifestyle was actually banned in almost, I think, either two of the games or all three. Oh my god, RTK very low. Can they bring him down in time? They are going to be able to kick up that kill at the very least. Meanwhile, Aggressive shows up. Going to be able to go to the GGJ, but... It's also where Aggressive is probably looking at this like, great, they're all going for Magic Immunity? Well, I'm going to go into a Desolator, and with a Deso, Armlet, Echo Saber, this Lifesteal is the most farmed hero in the game. Doesn't have the Deso yet, get another kill. But when he gets the Deso, he's going to shred through some of these liquids. Liquids over it. And top lane, Matu needs to be careful. Yeah. FY knows he's alone now. 
ROTK here as well. They're looking for the chase. Can they get the pullback? Stampede is there as well. They get the damage. He's gone in an instant. Wow. That's like the kind of play you'd expect from like FY, but Fenrir is showing like, hey man, they're actually sure. But using a four staff aggressively to astral yourself, that's like, hey, come and gank me, guys. Right next to a centaur. That was the easiest centaur hoopstop ROTK scene. Oh, good primal split. Yeah, and this is going to yeah. be enough to kill him off. And well, maybe you can use a little I, bit of that pulverize against the tower. Yeah, typically you want to save the primal split for a team fight or to like force like a big fight. But at this point, you haven't we haven't seen much out of it. So going for a single pick off, guaranteeing the kill, making sure there was a disable to stop his TP was the bigger part of that. And it did secure the Matia one tower as well. Bottom lane, GH in some trouble. Is going to force Staff away, trying to make the escape, but not going to happen. Fenrir and no. FY, the combo. Yeah, this was something the, the panelists talked a bit about. When it's like Timber, that can be fantastic. Is this the type of game where you feel like they're going to need to invest in something like the BKBs? Uh, pretty, oh, and I'd hold that thought. Mind control pulled in, going to get jumped upon. And they find that kill yet again. More track gold yeah. into the coffers of VGJ. Yeah. This smoke from Liquid is trying to secure them a Roche if possible. Oh, and ROTK, he didn't end up casting on himself this time. He's going to be on top of ROTK here, trying to bring them low. They get the stun. The right click oh. damage is going to be there enough. They get the lift up and actually able to steal the Astral, turn it back against them. Forced after way, he is going to be able to walk out of this one, trying to get down the aggressive. They are going to be able to find that kill. Now for more fair. No, he life steal. He jumped inside of Fenrir, able to escape. Oh, the plays are really real here. Is uh, detection? They've got dust. Now uh, Fenrir starting to drop low. Aggressive turns to fight, but is just going to rage out. But oh. great play there by Aggressive. And Fenrir, presence of mind to get close so that he could jump inside of him with oh, the Oh, Miracle too aggressive, my friend. Maybe it's some trouble now. Ends up going for the self astral, but they're going to be all on top of him as soon as they come out of here. He smelt freeze, but FY so fast with the instant lift pulls him into the base under the tier three towers and they want more. Astral there onto Matumba Man now. He does have his chakram out. Rage is gonna be down low. Can they take down this tanky Timbersaw there? Trying to kill him off for staff, trying to get away, but I'm not sure if it's gonna be enough. They get the blinding light pushbacks. So that's oh, gonna be this as well. They got the Astral again. Now they need to fight this if they want it. any self, but no, it's not gonna happen. Matumba Man goes down and save your buddy syndrome. It strikes again as Kuro falls. Three dead. BGJ. Whew. Well, in good news, Bounty was dead, so they weren't track kills. He's going to wait that mana leak to wear off. Team Liquid do not want to give up Arax at this comes. point. They're going to go in for it. The right clicks are there, trying to jump in. There's they haven't been able to catch him. They don't get the ulti off as of yet. They are going to be able to bring down Mind Control. He has buyback, but Kuro's already gone as well as Matumbo Man in some trouble. They're going to pull him back out, but they do manage to save those barracks at least for now. Astral set up. Oh, he's in some trouble. They're going to go for it now. They get the Hurricane Pike off. He ends up going for another self Astral. Aggressive on top of GH, able to force staff away. They're on top of him yet again. He's already gone. Miracle might need to buy back, but it would be such a huge investment for this fight. They're trying to take down anybody if they can, but another Astral. FY saving him from the go-through, and they're able to get out again. They don't have to force this, but they want kills. They know they're 5v3. Well, jump forward. FY catches another in that Astral. And he's able to dodge away from the Metunvalan damage. Mind control. It's going to be tracked. They jump forward, go for the ultimate. Finally committed now. Can they find any kills? Freeze. Four staffed away. He ends up throwing the chakra. He's going to connect just on the very tip. And it does look like Freeze able to walk away. He's in the shadow blade. They don't have vision. They're not going to be able to see them. And, well, they are going to be able to bring down FY. That's at least something. The stampede with the Aghanims. They're just running the hell out of here. Get us away. And it looks like VGJ might just be able to do that. Oh, Miracle knows with all the buybacks with the lost racks, they got to chase and find more. They may just be able to get aggressive here, but he gets the infest. Inside Fenrir, they finally find the dust, okay. trying to jump out. Everybody just is going to force stab him away. And they find one, they find two. Liquid finds some solace in this game. Slight solace. They did not get the most gold for those kills because Miracle was still affected by the buy. Oh. The brew is not going to scale too much further, I guess, is one good thing. But OD can still get a lot more in the way of items. He's got a BKB slot, a Shivers slot, a Refresher slot. Like, he can do a lot more as this game, if this game drags. Oh, is the Sheep Stick used as well? Matumba Man is 
out there. They're sending out a Centaur just to stomp up Fenrir for the moment, but a Stomp going to be able to connect another Force Staff, keeping that Coddle alive for the moment, but no, he's going to drop, and they're all over him at this point. Forced to use it. They are going to use the Bruce Split over here to the side. Maybe going to be able to get the lift up on our ROTK. Matumbo Man also there. Can deal a good bit of damage if they can stay on top of one, but they're just actually back on top of him. ROTK, he's found the initiation on a Miracle. He is going to fall. Peeping away in the back lines was Freeze, but Four heroes potentially going to go down as Matumbo Man is being controlled and right clicked. Another Astral saving him for the moment. Well played there, but they're on top of him. Good sheep stick as well. Matumbo Man out of the base for the moment. Throws out the Chakram. They're trying to chase, trying to kill, and they do find that one. Just wow. too much. It really is too much at this point. No buyback on Brew. OD just committed his. Even if you somehow hold, it just feels like Liquid's in a close to unwinnable position. They've just invested too much for this defense. They've chewed through the mana of the lifestyle. They need to find kills here. Pushing back beachy gaming is not enough. Getting kills is a necessity. Oh my god, the big Sandy's Eclipse able to bring down one. They're so low right now, but because of the bonus moves, they know they take down kills. one. All right, Fenrir gone. More. Possibly going to be able to take down RTK as well. They got the Chakram out, and Miracle on the other side was able to take down FY. He's Three are already done. RTK trying to get out. Blink Dagger up. He blinks the other way. Nice play there to the side. Well, another movement now in towards the mid lane, and it looks like they actually want to set up for a fight. The tower is already down, so they have vision inside of it. They pop the ulti there on top of GH. He's gone. Buys back immediately. Miracle, Hurricane Pike trying to escape, is going to go inside of that, and the Brew ulti does come out as well, trying to turn this, but BKBs are popped all around. Matumba Man in Miracle. the midst of all of them. Can they kill off Miracle? He's so, so low. He gets another Astra dodging he's away from the Assassinate. Needs to force that as soon as he's out. Nice blink away. Well played. There, maybe they've done too deep here as they're trying to look to pick up a I couple think they kills have here. Miracle. They've dove way too deep here, aggressive. He's exposed. Controlled for the moment. They're still stunned up. Hex now down on top of him. Stolen They're able split. to steal it. And this is an Aghanim split as well. Can FY do enough with it? Another Astral trying to save Miracle. The four steps have been so clutch for Liquid throughout this. But they're fighting almost under the tier fours at this point. Aggressive has Kuroki in a corner. Able to find the kill with the Infest come out as well. And now Matumbo Man tries to take down Aggressive. Mind control there again. Right clicks coming through. The drop the Sanity's Eclipse. Rubik gets up stealing it. He turns it back around. He it's an Aghanim's Eclipse. Oh my gosh! They the Ags OD ulti, it does something lyrical! <laughs> and here Reddit it? told me it was the worst Ags upgrade in the game. Oh my goodness. They're chasing down FY, who is going to end up trying to get out of here. Has a Blink Dagger up in one. Lift up could come. Is stealing away the Chakram, the Blinding Light back, but FY is going to die. It okay, got maybe, RTK yeah, out he, he didn't escape. Okay, it's still, <laughs> still the worst. Still the worst. <laughs> We're fine. Phew. <laughs> Whoa, that was... Hold on his own. It looks like that's going to be the case. BKB TP out. Does mean you can kill Shrines. Take away that slight point of map control. And they're chasing for some kills here too. Shuriken bouncing. They're on top of Kuroki wanting to save their buddies. But is it going to work? They end up going for the E-Blade now onto Kuro. But he's going to take bonus damage from that from the Assassinate. Matumbo Man needs to find a tree. Is going to get it. And still the chase. Perhaps I think that'll <laughs> okay. be the shift in tactics, you know. Diving the heroes, that didn't work. This time around, OD will have buyback too. And problem is when you oh. bottom lane okay. again, they're just gonna keep on doing he this. He needs to survive though. Uh, this, I mean, it's a lot of damage coming in onto this panda, and he does have blink when he eventually comes out of it. He takes the tower. He's dying. He's dead. He's gonna be willing to right live his life for that. If I was like, "Come on, bro, why are you gonna kill him? I want that steal." But if he blinks away and TP's out, that would prize. Well, they should have done perhaps earlier, but I think they're still in a position where there's. Some wiggle room to at least get this second set of racks. Question is, can they get more? Oh, looking for more. They actually oh. pop the Lincoln Sphere, but he's going to be controlled for the moment. And is it going to also get out that Ghost Scepter? So fine for the moment. They're on top of him. Aggressive takes down the melee. Miracle in some Great trouble. E Another E-Blade from two separate teammates is going to keep him alive. But they do finally bring down Miracle. Buys back. And now BGJ realized they cannot stick around. Isn't going to do it. This is their last racks, Lyrical. I don't think they can play against Mega Creeps. They've got to just engage. All right, jump forward, trying to find it. Aggressive is Another there. Rage. They've got Miracle as well. This is not going to be a buyback. If he does go down, they're on top of him, trying to chase. They're going to be able to do a bit more damage, but now they've stolen Astro from Rubik as well. So another saving spell is there. The OD forced to Astro himself for the moment. And man, this sniper is just doing so much damage in this team fight. ROTK continuing the chase. And there it is. A dieback for Miracle. ROTK, too much of 
Matumba Menace. Matumba Man running away, but going to get pulled back in by FY Lifted. And this could potentially be just about it as Freeze just barely alive, but still dealing so much, so much damage. And GG is going to be called. And you can hear the elation of the crowd. Uh, this is... I had hopes.